What's up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. Hi, hello, how are we? Happy whatever day of week it is for you. I'm coming at you with an updated what I eat in a day. I feel like we haven't done one in a while and how fitting to be in a kitchen, me and my cupboards, toxic trait, um, and just start off the morning. So, Michael's away on a business trip. So it's just me and Sir Benton, and I had coffee the first thing in the morning, sat outside, did some manifestation, it was beautiful. As I was doing it, the sun peeked through, and then I worked a bit and popped down to our Starbucks, which took Bentley out, and I got a salted cream cold brew, and, I was kind of wanting it really creamy. Sometimes it's creamy and sometimes it's not. Still good, still good. So I'm going to make breakfast. I'm making eggs and a bagel and cream cheese. Honestly, years ago, you would never catch me eating a bagel and cream cheese because I was like so scared. It was 10 loaves of bread or whatever. You know, that weird saying that everybody would say. Now I'm like, I want a bagel. I live in New York, New York. So YOLO. Let's make it. I belong, I belong to you. I belong, I belong to you. snagged a banana and then I also got the Raz Cran La Croix. La Croix. Do you call it La Croix or La Croix? Okay, so. Oh my gosh, wait guys. Look how cute Billy's being. He's like a little squirrel. I'm also stretching. Oh, I was working and then I have a new project coming up. Some of you gals are a part of it. Um, so I was just like last minute, had a meeting and editing with that. And so it is now almost one. I wanted to go to the gym early, but that's never my case because something always comes up. Um, Mike was helping me with the new project and he was like, can you get this done in an hour? And I was like, well, I had 20 other things to do, but sure. So I took a quick break right now and I'm making me lunch. I cannot go to the gym like hangry. Otherwise, I will not have a productive workout and today's leg day. I did solid core yesterday. It was like leg wrap and biceps and I'm sore, but like, I don't know guys, I don't care. I want to go freaking lift some heavy weights right now and maybe I'll do more full body because I'm feeling like really sore in my legs and my glutes, especially my glutes. Um, but what I'm making is had the burner warming up. So I popped in two chicken spring rolls into the microwave. I'm frying them up. These are the chicken spring rolls I love from Trader Joe's. And then I got a bag of salad. I had it with tofu last night, but honestly I'm a little burnt out on tofu. Bag salad of, guys, this is fantastic. It's like a Thai salad. So uh, it comes with all these different ingredients. Like I have uh, crispy wontons, I have peanuts, I have peanut sauce. So I'm just gonna make a salad with egg rolls because I just wasn't feeling the tofu. Okay, I know I rave about sweet chili, and I know I have a problem with this, okay? I eat so much sweet chili every day. It, it is a problem because it's pure sugar, 
and I'm willing to look past it for now. So I like putting it on my egg rolls. It's just the best thing and it, I've replaced ranch with it. And that's a lot. Okay, the day has gotten ahead of me, per usual. I clearly am not the best time management, but I um, am having a quick cuddle. Kind of explains it. I get distracted. Um, I'm heading to thy gym, finally. I'm gonna do the sauna, I'm gonna do the cold plunge. I've really been working on meditation and manifesting lately, and I just, I love doing it there, especially during the cold plunge. It's just like you and your thoughts and like, you can't back out of it, right? Like it's a cold plunge, it's uncomfortable and you really have to just like speak great thoughts into your head. Um, also, it only smells like corn chips. You know dogs smell like corn chips, like a bacteria on their paws. But anyways, I'm wearing the new Vital. Wow, that was not a pretty angle. And you know what guys? It's a bad angle of me. Let's be real, okay? That's okay. Anyways, I'm wearing the new Vital. They have all these different colors dropping. I uploaded a haul for you guys. I love it, I think it's fantastic and I just love what they're representing with it. Um, so I honestly did a YouTube review on this and I'm just gonna wear it to the gym and just bring a change of clothes for when I go swimming. Well, swimming, when I go into the sauna and the cold plunge. And yeah, I have a program call with my gals tonight. Bentley, I just asked him if he wanted to have a doggo date night and we're either gonna go to Bryant Park and maybe have dinner together, uh, just the two of us, or, well, and we're gonna have a movie night. That's the plan. My mom gave me some good recs for some movies and I need to finish The Bachelorette, um, but let's get ready, let's go to the gym and it's gonna be a great lift. She's marrying Michael and I, and we're catching up. So I had chips, salsa, I was snacking away. I just didn't record it because I was on the phone. Then I got Chipotle, because I want more chips, more salsa. And I just didn't feel like cooking tonight, and I am in Bryant Park. I figured I'd just take myself on a little date, because this city just never sleeps. But I'll show you what I got. I got the setup. And Bentley's with me. I am obsessed with Bryant Park and I always will be. I just love how there's like a yoga class, people are just reading, hanging out. It just is my happy place and I come here almost every day. And then we have Sir Benton, he's enjoying his outdoor life. 
This is the setup. Chicken with all, I literally get everything on it except spicy. Everything else is on here. And then chips to dip it in. All right, hello. I have been editing this video. And it's literally, it's been a week now. And it was a fun day. Honestly, 10 out of 10 recommend taking yourself to Chipotle, that was belly, and having yourself a nice little date. I literally like for 30 minutes, just didn't even have headphones in, just listened around. Then I called Nona, my girl, and talked to her for an hour, it was lovely. I do wanna say something. I've noticed with my what I eat in a days, depending on the stage of my life and where I'm living and things like that, I constantly change with my diet in a sense of like, sometimes I'm more holistic, maybe I, I'm really good with my macros, or maybe I, I really prioritize my fruits and my veggies and cooking on my meals. I feel like I'm more like that when I live, when I'm more at home, where we're in New York for the summer and it's just been really fun and like I'm just having bigger meals opposed to like lots of snacks and I'm busy, I'm running around, I eat out, I don't necessarily have like the healthiest meal choices. So I just wanted to highlight that because this is a season. This isn't my permanent lifestyle. And I just noticed that, that I was like, wow, it's really like kind of chaotic what I eat lately. And that's okay. And I just want to say that that's totally fine if you're in that phase, it's summer and that's normal. And it's impossible to be on point all the time. And it was honestly kind of a wake up call to just be like, I'm gonna prioritize my protein a little bit more. I'm gonna prioritize my fruits and veggies and things like that. So. Just a friendly reminder that that's okay if you're in that point of your lifestyle and that don't watch this and think she's really healthy or don't watch this and think she's not healthy because it was a random day in my life and I'm just out here trying to live. So with that being said, don't forget to like and subscribe to YouTube channel and I will see you next time.